the enormity of, of my crimes which makes the word sorry all but inadequate. It would seem like an insult to even say it. But I still need to say it. Whether it's received or not, I am sorry. So very sorry. Tell him the truth. Tell him what I did. I had no right to take the lives of Jennifer, Rita, Lisa, Noni, Cynthia, Christine, or any, or Tanya. There is never a day that I don't struggle within the very core of my heart and soul. I became so overwhelmed, repulsed, broken by my own evil carnage, I literally died to self. I desperately sought spiritual rescue from my own personal demons. So yes, I sought a new God. You have heard from some of the good people who have supported my journey since I have been in prison, providing study tools and fellowship. Because of what I've done and caused, I have literally sentenced the lives and the hearts of the victim's family members to a lifetime of precious loss and sorrow. I have clearly shown to all of myself that I belong in prison for the rest of my life. I absolutely agree that I have forfeited my place in free society and that I forever belong behind bars till I die. And yes, death will surely visit me in its due course. <laughs> 